Hey, what's up guys? My name is Andy Spelt and welcome back to a brand new fishing video. This is not exactly the type of video I thought I'd be making today, but as you guys saw by the title, you already know what's going on. In no way am I trying to make this sound like, oh, COVID's so cool. COVID's a cool thing to have. COVID's fun. It's not. I'm just trying to make the best out of this. And uh, really, I don't want to just sit at home and watch TV all day. I'm, I'm not hanging out with friends. I'm not going anywhere. Only reason I'm leaving the house, hopped in my truck and went to a nearby trout stream. Who am I going to give COVID to? The trees, the fish, probably, but I'll try not to. It's going to be a fun video. I just want to go and have some fun. I want to catch some trout. And uh, whew, it's a nice day. I mean, it was snowing two days ago, but snow's gone. 45 degrees right now. We, of course, starting off with the G. Loomis Trout Rod Fluger Summit XT 4-pound test. And, of course, Panther Martin 132. Actually, I think this is a 116 pounds. Yeah, 116th ounce. So we're gonna have some fun today, guys. We're gonna definitely catch some fish. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's get out there. You guys smell that? That's the smell of some stream trout. Oh, oh, wow. Wow, wow, wait, it's clear. Is that just my sunglasses? No, it is clear. Let's see if we can, oh, we got a couple trout right there. Oh, there he was. I didn't stay on. These are, these are some big, what I just saw right there is a very big trout. Oh, here comes one, here comes one. Wow, they're not active. Here comes, there he is. Got him. Ah, that's a little guy. I mean, they're they're, they're kind of tapping it a bit. But no, there's, there's definitely a big one in there. That's all right, this guy's a nice little guy. Alrighty, there you go, buddy. Awesome. Well, caught the smallest one out of there, but that's all right. Ooh, you know, I, I might be able to fish this. It's gonna be hard. Okay, well, if I don't catch a tree, I'll be able to fish it. Really? I know this is... I know this is a hole here. So where are the fish at? Oh, there he was. Oh, there he is again. There he is. Oh, really? It's a good sign to hit though. Oh, there he is. Ah, little guy. Oh, you can, oh, it's insane. Oh, it's a brook. Nice. You can see him. Oh, I mean, take that out of the water, but I'm gonna let out some slack. You can see him in the water. I mean, it's so clear. That was just beautiful. Let's keep going. I'm gonna get right back in the water. There he is. That's not a bad one. Come on, buddy. Yeah, that's not bad. Oh, it's beauty. The colors on these fish are just incredible. Wow. What a beautiful fish. All right, buddy. All right. Let's get him back in the water. There he goes, right under that tree. That was, I gotta say that that is one nice, oh, there he is. There he is. That's a nice one. Whoa. I mean, he's already, okay. You do you, buddy. What? No, no, no. Nope, nope, no. That's not what we do around here. We do not steal lures. All right. Beauty. Nice little guy, about what? A little 12, 13 inches. He's gonna get right back in there and go say hello to his family. I've been looking for like 10 minutes now. I cannot find where I just threw that spinner. I even looked back at the video. Where did I throw it? I was standing right here. I turned and I went, hmm, and then threw it right there. It should be right here. But it's not. Interesting. Well, there goes that. That was my favorite Let's one. Let's see what we can do here. 
There's a lot of trees. Just, there he is. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's not a bad fish. Whoa. Jeez, buddy. Whoa, yeah, that's, a, that's a beauty. Let's get up here. Yeah, that's the biggest one of the day. Cool. There's so much trees and stuff down. Good cover for them. But it's going to be almost impossible to fish. Like this here. Why is this thing not spin? You for sure always get one out of here. There he is. Oh, that's a nice one too. Why is he... What is he doing? Why do they fight like that? I just don't understand that. Like, just, they spin in circles. Like, there's so much easier ways to fight, buddy. You don't have to spin in circles. Come on, now. There you go, buddy. Whoa. Nice. Darker orange, too. Looks to me like a brook. Can't be a hunt. Yeah, it's a brook. If you stop moving, yeah, it's a brook. Cute little guy. Man, brooks are by far just the prettiest trout out there. And I just love them. Even if they're small, I love them. I might be able to fish this. Okay, well, not if I cast like that, I won't. That'll get one. There he is. Buddy, you are really just trying to get yourself tangled. That is a nice fish, too. He's just trying to get himself tangled. Wet the hands and grab it. Ah, that's a nice one. Yes, man, look at that. Another beautiful trout. And there he goes. Beauty. No. Well, this one's gonna be hard to fish. Oh, that was the best cast I've ever done today, of course. I had some pretty gnarly casts yesterday. What? Really? That was actually one heck of a snap, too. All right, let's see if we can pull something out of this right here. I see, I see there is fish. There he is. It's like a little brown. They are just, they're jumping all over today. I just don't understand it. It's like, look at them, like, buddy. I know it's a Friday, but come on. Relax a little bit. I'm just trying to have a good day. I'm not trying to... I don't know, whatever you guys do, I don't, I'm not trying to jump around with you. Where are the big dogs at? There's got, there's got, I'm telling you right now, there's got to be something nice somewhere in this stream. I don't know where, what part of it, I don't know where, but somewhere in this stream, there's got to be a, at least close to a trophy trout. Oh, I don't know why, but birds scare me when they jump like that. What is that? Don't know, don't really want to know. Oh yeah, right here. This is fish territory. There he is. Flopping all around again. Yeah, let's, let's run back upstream. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Yeah, back upstream. 
Look at you go. That's a nice one. Okay. It's like I was walking, walking a dog. I was just walking them right upstream. Gosh, these fish are just incredible. On the road again, catching fish I haven't caught again. There he is. Little guy. I'm trying to see if I can just pop him off. Looks like a little brook to me. Eh, not a bad brook. Man, that's probably the biggest brook today, I think. Cut any closer than that second one. The white tips and everything are just nothing like it. There he is. Nice. Out there. He is just going for just, I don't, I don't know what I was going with when I was at that, uh, that sentence there. I don't know if I was going to say he's going for a ride or he's just trying to jump, but man. What a cute little guy. Go over here. Of course. Whoa. Wet hand, wet hand. Grab the fish. Of course, wet your hands, guys. A lot of people tell me there's no reason to do that, or it's stupid, or it's, oh, they're just trout, but it doesn't matter the fish. Take good care of them, let them go, and uh, let them see another day. No reason to hurt these fish. The thing about trout is they're not all in deep holes. A lot of them, which I'd say most of them, are in spots that are just super shallow. They're just waiting in the rapids for food to come down. That's why a lot of people take up fly fishing, because it's, it's extremely effective. I just enjoy using a spinner. But, I mean, spots like this, that's probably, what, a foot and a half deep? But there's probably piles of trout just waiting there for, for food to come down. What you want to do is cast at the mouth of it and just bring it in slowly like this. You know, of course, you're not always going to get a bit a bite. That was a fish, though, right there. You're not always going to get a fish, but give it a couple more casts. Oh, here comes one. Oh, 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 and he backed off. But yeah, just keep casting at it, and you should be able to get one. This doesn't seem too deep. Oh, the rocks are moving a bit. That's never been, I mean, I've never caught anything out of here, but. There he is. Just not expecting one out of that, I'll be honest. <laughs> Gosh, these fish, I mean, I, don't, I, I say it a lot and I'll say it again. These fish are incredible. I mean, they're just, they're gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Had to give him a little kissy. See ya, buddy. This looks good just because of how deep it is. There he is. That's a nice trout. What is that? Is he trying to eat it? Look it. That other brook just tried to eat this one. There's two huge brook in here. This isn't the biggest one, but it's still a nice one. There is a big brook in there. That's a nice one, though. There is some big trout right there. Wow. That's still the biggest one of the day. Awesome. All right, I'm going to have to call it a day. I got to get home, finish up with some homework. Yeah, today was fun. Nothing wrong with it. We, uh, I'm really hoping I don't get any comments that are like, oh my gosh, you should be staying inside, you shouldn't be out. Like, really, am I gonna give the water COVID? Like, it's not like I go, go to the bait shop, grab some lures, you know, go go fish with some other people. Literally just hop, go from my house, hop in the car, go straight to the spot, no one's here. I don't see any problem with it. I know someone, I know there's gonna be someone out there who's gonna tell me I'm a terrible person, like, 
I already know what's gonna happen. I'm already preparing for it. So, whatever. I mean, people be people. Nothing I can do about that. How am I gonna get out of here? That's the real question, but hope you guys did enjoy today's video. I've been trying to post more. I'm gonna head to Texas in a week. So I don't know if I'm gonna post this first, the Texas first. Well, if you guys see the Texas first, then you see this, that might be a little bit weird. <laughs> but uh, yeah, hope you guys did enjoy the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.